Hi guys, welcome to the Cocktail Kitchen with the Urban Swain Girls. Today we're hanging out with Greg Austin of Kiron's Houston, also known as Mr. Bartender Extraordinaire. Or also known as the Martini Czar. Did you Absolutely. know you had so many titles? I did not. Hey, you are the man. All right. You works. are the man, you are the spirit man. Okay. Okay, and not the holy kind, I'm sorry, but. The spirits man. <laughs> spirit the spirit man. man. Plural, plural. So, what's going on? What are you gonna be cooking up for us today in the cocktail kitchen? We are going to be making a chocolate jalapeno martini. Woo, mm. see this is like a man I like. He's so did someone tell you she loved chocolate and I love spice? Is actually, that actually that's true? Um, mm. uh, he got take the inside. Notes. Take got notes, the... man. This is it's he... all it's all about uh, remembering what you hear and putting it to you. And putting there it to you. Go. Hello, and we he love single it. ladies. I'm just saying. I'm, <laughs> okay, okay. Let's focus. So Let's focus. chocolate, <laughs> jalapeno, jalapeno, martini. martini. Wow. Right. Okay. So start off with mm, jalapeno. Mm -hmm. Now it depends on how hot that you want it mm -hmm. okay. is how many how much you do it how much you do it okay how many seeds that you put in okay will be depending on the heat right now we'll slice one for a garnish at the end and now, we'll I was gonna back. ask you do you taste it because you know even though you're like adding you leave more seeds take some out you know sometimes they're still some jalapenos are hotter than others correct right right no okay. Um, if I tasted every drink I've made, I wouldn't have a job very long. Right, yeah, okay. I'm just wondering, because, you know, I'm like thinking, if I were making it for Urban Girl, because she, she doesn't, she likes spice, but she didn't like a lot of spice, oh, and I like spice. a lot, so, um, yeah. I Can you tell? Right. So I guess your guests will just have to. But typically with this, with this martini, I don't make it real spicy. Okay. Um, the way the flavors come out, you get the, the sweetness up front, at the very end you get some heat at the back of your throat. If you make it too hot, then all you taste is the heat, and you don't really get the flavor of the okay. chocolate. Okay, got it. So we cut up just mainly the, the meat of the jalapeno. It's okay. got a little bit of the, the white ribs, which would be some heat. Okay. And we'll put just just a couple of seeds. Okay, I see so what you're put doing. this in here. Yeah. Yep, truly just a little heat. Right, right. Yeah. we'll put just, I don't know, couple seeds. Okay. All right. Then <clears throat> we're going to take a little bit of stolly vanilla so we can mash up the jalapenos. It's called muddling with okay. a muddler. It's right. a gift from a friend of mine, which by the way is a very good muddler. And that's a pretty muddler. Yeah, that's Absolutely. a pretty nice muddler. Now are so, you doing, it looks like you're doing an intense muddle. Okay, well you have to break up the seeds and you have okay. to okay. break up the flesh so you get the flavor out. Got it. Right. Okay. okay. So, mash that around a little bit. So, no wussy muddling, people. No wussy <laughs> muddling, absolutely not. Work it out. So, okay. I, I put about a quarter ounce of Stoli vanilla in there, so we're going to put about oh, another yeah. ounce. Right. Just like Swanky Girl ice. like I absolutely. know. Grab some ice. Use uh, about the same. Okay. I love about it. About an ounce of Kahlua. And about... About I see where two ounces, ounces of Godiva Dark. Now you know what okay. a lot of people do because you put all these in, they would do, they would cut it. Oh, I'm gonna cut this in half because I'm putting yeah, this. Right. You go straight in. Absolutely. Okay. Commit to it. Just I like yeah. A dash of half and half. Well, that's an interesting. Now, what does that do to the cocktail? It makes it a little bit smoother than it would be right. if you just okay. have the alcohol. Go, although the Godiva is pretty smooth. The half and a half just makes it very silky. Okay. So typically, that this is sense. a dessert drink. Okay. Although there are lots of people that start out the evening with it. Uh, you shake it usually when you shake the martini, you shake it very hard. Mm -hmm. with this martini, if you shake it hard, it foams up. So you want to shake it mm -hmm. kind of softly. You don't want right. to. Soft you don't shake. Want to, okay. Yeah, soft so shake. Let me make sure. I'm muddling intensely, <laughs> but I'm shaking. Soft, kind of. Okay, yeah, yeah. Got it. Once you shake it around a little bit to get the ingredients, you still get. It still needs to be chilled a little bit. So just swirl it around that way. It's not getting too much froth. Right. Strainer. Pour that in your martini glass. Mm, mm, mm. Take a little bit of dark chocolate for garnish. Mm. It's great on now there. That's a kind of topping that I like. That's it. And there we have it, ladies. One chocolate jalapeno martini. Would you like to taste? 
I would. Thank you. Oh, picking sides, picking I'm, sides. You know, I think <laughs> he noticed that I was really yeah, into you're it, clearly and I probably <laughs> needed a drink. <laughs> right. Well, actually, she has a wedding ring, and you don't. So that's no, true. I don't. Hey. Again, very <laughs> close attention. <laughs> attention, Pay attention to, to detail. The details. That's Men, totally. take note. That's all I'm saying. Please do. That is good. It's and it has the after. It has the after kick. Not too hot for the jalapeno. Not too hot. Yeah. Okay. Yes. That's, you can pass that really over good. here, young lady. I am. You know, my pretty, husband's pretty gonna, pink. I don't have a ring. My husband's going to kick my butt. But oh, hey, we're not even talking about that. You're in trouble. Love ya. You're in trouble. Shame on you. <laughs> oh, my. Sinfully good. Yeah. Sinfully, I see why you're bizarre. That's, yeah, right. I mean, this you is. You created. That's your creation. You kind of. That's good. That's good. <laughs> that is good. I think we have a winner here, guys. You know, you can always check out this at Karen's Houston. You can try to make it at home, but I'm telling you, you're going to want to come here to get a sip of this. Isn't that right? That's right. But again, we're going to give you the recipe and check it out. So until soon, thanks, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>